it's a early opportunity for Kashmir down this right wing side cutting into the area and in fact uh, shooting into did that collect the post or was it into the post behind the goal a little bit of uh, and a shooting chance which uh, had Mike interested enough very good uh, feet to uh, Ollie Fay. edge of the area chance for uh, Auckland United not able to keep the shot down was Zambrano looking to create space for the shot goes wide Straight back in, handy from Kashmir. Coughlin goes down and a penalty's given. The referee has adjudicated here that the challenge was late, illegal. Can he score his eighth of the season? Little hesitation, that is class, that is quality. And he does get his eighth goal of the season. And the visitors have... Uh, Den Haier can't wrap the left foot around that, but careful not to give a free kick away, but just looking to a blocker's line of sight, if nothing else. Knight tries to come out and doesn't get there. And perhaps a Zambrano was doing the right thing, and there is the goal. So Auckland United are level. What have they got now on the counter, Kashmir? Matheson advancing and ignored. A strike on goal should have been better from Barbara Ryan. Marathi just overran it into the penalty area. Still somehow have possession through Redfern. Driven across, eluding the keeper and eluding Marathi. Barbara Ryan finding room for the shot and just over the crossbar. That's been the story of their day. Kashmir do have players forward. A drive into the gloves of Mac Waite for United. Time is against them now. Urgency coming into their game. Oh, a chance for Zambrano, and they've got the goal. And it's Nicholas Zambrano. The 78th minute. And it was the substitute that knocked it across. And that might be the last piece of action. It is Auckland United 2, Kashmir Technical 1.